Hi, Leo. This is Jeffrey. This is your weekly reading for the week of uh, November 7th through the 14th. Please like, subscribe, share, comment, press the bell for notifications. I offer private readings uh, on Zoom or in person. I also offer, oh, let me make everything perfect. <laughs> I'm a set designer. Okay. Um, I also offer IET, which is a healing modality. And um, it, it helps you to release energy. You're doing the work. I'm just the uh, facilitator, right? Your soul does the work. Your soul and your angels, our angels, the angels. <laughs> Information is below. And, uh, I have a lovely website where I have textiles like so, like so, uh, and t-shirts, handmade t-shirts, you know, one of a kind. I also have astrology t-shirts, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, go check them out, ripecolor.com. The monthlies are up. And I'm starting with Leo. You're my first sign. This I felt very fiery somewhere red and well it was the only it was the one that i had at iron laced and I was like, yeah, let me start with fire this week mm. you know i do a different order every week okay ah. Ah. when i try to talk and shuffle i cannot seem to do it okay let's get to it all right, so what's up for Leo, 7th through the 14th of November? One, two, three. Okay. Okay. Uh, you know, it's Scorpio season, so it's no surprise that death comes up. I think death is a great card um, because death really moves you forward. So there's been some sort of transformation. I feel like, and, and you have a new strategy already. You know, it's like you have an idea and you have a strategy. Well, you know, grass doesn't grow under your feet. Um, yeah, it's like something that, maybe you put a lot of effort into something and now it's dead or it's done. And, but you got something from it. There's some, there was something that was valuable in there and you're going to like go back to the drawing board. So you learned a lesson, right? You learned a lesson and you're going back to the drawing board. You have like a new concept, a new idea, a new passion, and you already have a strategy. It's a good beginning. It's a good beginning. One, two, three. There you go. Here you are. It's like, you know, I'm going to take it on. Right, I know how to do this because you have the page, the knight, and the king. Boom, 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 in a row. My computer is like so alive behind <laughs> my screen. I have no idea. And then you have the fool, so you're starting on a whole new journey. You have decisions to make. I feel really good about this reading. You know, so far I feel really good because I, I feel like this death card is actually, so the death card is really like the card of the fall. And, it, you know, it's, it's like the leaves dying, right? And then nourishing the soil so that something new can come up. And that's exactly what's going on. Because, uh, But I feel like there's something and something you did or you just finished or, or it finished itself. And... Uh, you got a lesson, you got, you got um, valuable information and you're able to use it and move forward, right? Move forward in a whole new way, in a whole new way, you know, and it's, there's, and you're, this is, you know, stability. You'll know what to do. This is, you know, very much like, should I stay or should I go? Um, and, you know, this is like that point in battle for me. This is that point in battle where it's like you're surrounded and it's like, well, should I stay and fight or should I let it go and come back another day? 
like that. So this thing that had ended was quite overwhelming. I think you're going to give it up and then come back to fight another day. You know, you felt surrounded. And so, you know, you have a whole new strategy and you're, you're doing it in a whole different way. Yeah. Oh my God. So many wands, so many wands. There might be something that you have to close out in order to move forward. There might be something that you have to close out in order to move forward with your new strategy. Yeah, and here you go. Execution of the plan. Execution of the plan. There's an enthusiasm to him. There's an intuitiveness to him. There's uh, uh, a will and a... Uh, and a desire to like move, you know, move quickly. You know, I, I think things are gonna be moving really quickly for a lot of people this month. You're the king, you're the emperor. I think that there was this really important lesson that you just learned. This really, really valuable um, uh, situation or undertaking that didn't work the way you thought it was going to work and it's like oh okay this is really really good mulch to use to move forward right like yeah yeah so so you know i don't know if some of you know but i'll tell you <laughs> i had a t-shirt business for a long time and i was just talking to a friend about it so I used to hand dye t-shirts by myself and then I would put like an image on them. That's where the horoscope stuff comes from. And I had, I was selling about 14 or 15 stores at one time and it was my livelihood and it was, and it, while it worked, it was great. And then when the economy got weird, la la la, it all just, but it all, it all just disintegrated, right? But out of that, I was able to build other things and I learned a lot and what I learned was, you know, that I have good ideas, that I understand things, that I know what sells, that I know how to make t-shirts, blah, blah, blah. But I was spending so much time because I was literally making every single one by hand by myself and screening them and selling them and shipping them. I made my own labels. I sewed in my own labels. It just went on and on and on and on. And, but I learned a lot through it. And I, what I, you know, at the end of the day, what I really learned was, um, like how much effort I have to put into something in order to make it um, uh, make money from it, right? And so now I'm at a place where it's like, no, I'm not working 70 or 80 hours a week hand making thing. Like I can't do that anymore. But I learned a lot through that process. And so that experience um, showed me like a lot of, of what people want, what sells, da, 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 da. and so it was really valuable, but it was time that it had to, it was kind of taken away from me, right, in a way, and it was a blessing, it was a blessing, because I learned a lot, and uh, I'm able to use that uh, experience in order to move forward. Right. Sometimes you're at some job or something, or you have an experience like a, a personal experience with somebody, uh, you know, like a relationship, and it just fizzles out. And then, you know, a while later, it's like, well, this person taught me that. You know, they taught me about myself or about how I approach things or about. So the, nothing is wasted. Nothing is wasted. And I feel like you're able to use all that information and that experience to really uh, fire you up to move forward. So I, I think it's a really good reading. Seven through the 14th, blessings. Thanks for tuning in. The monthlies are up, dailies. Talk to you soon. Blessings.